Hello there. Uh, just received my ARC droid in the mail today um, from DHL uh, two days earlier than expected. So I guess the shipping is running good from China to here. Um, that's exciting. Um, so let me open this up. somewhere where they talked about the vendor switched switches on them and this one this little thing might break so I think that's what they're talking about and then it's got some little pointers on here probably to replace this one with so I'll have to find out where this goes it's got a little auxiliary connector so this is the switch that if you're not careful can break something mm -hmm. so hopefully that doesn't happen <clears throat> but it looks like if it does it can be replaced by taking out these three screws here and then pulling this off and then these little doohickeys probably replace this one when this nub gets worn down and there's a network cable power cable Some bars. So three bars. Not sure what for. Well, I'm sure they're for this. We'll find out here. Some stickers. And here we have the stylus attachment. To go on the torch location. So it looks like you open these little clips and stick it on there and then close them. And it's also got an auxiliary connector on it. So it, I'm assuming it's powered and there's a little button right there. And there's another one of these doohickeys. Oh, careful, these little rubber things come off real easy. So apparently those rubber things get stuck on the side of this thing. So if you just leave them like that, hopefully it'll work on the device like that. So in the box is the arc droid. It's a little heavier than I expected, but I guess that's a good thing. Okay, right down here it says always secure arc droid to work surface before cutting. And over here it says do not connect plasma ground to arc droid always ground directly to material. For best results, level the arc droid using this, this surface. So I guess the idea is to... I don't have a level in here. Let's see how level is my desk. So instead of using this style, I would probably use the dot and put it on there. So it says to level it using this surface, but the seems like the 
line level or bubble level would be harder because you have to go like this. So if you use the dot level, that might be better because then you can like just adjust it, but it doesn't give you a number. pin where does it attach there's two screws sticking out here so maybe it goes like doesn't quite fit on there Probably gonna lose these little black covers. That's probably the first thing that's gonna disappear. So that goes like that. And then this goes. I should read the instructions. Oh, right over here on this side. So looking at it, I have the pin on here with the clips holding it onto these little Allen bolts that stick out right there. So whenever you push up on this, it pops the cable out of the top up there. So maybe when you turn it on, the machine will retract the pin up so that it doesn't hit the table that it's sitting on. Um, not sure exactly where you would put this cable, but over on this side, there's a little plug right there that the cable goes into. And there's something here, I'm not sure what that is. And then the network cable jack and a USB port. And then on the back there's torch auxiliary and auxiliary and the power and the on off button. And then this right up here is a limit switch so that it would stop when it gets back there. So I'll take this off so I can think properly. to its limit switch. So this limit switch right there hits on here and I think that's because it has some motion like this after the big arm has hit this limit switch because it can go like that. Cool. So the next thing in this box is the computer. No instruction manual. Oh, so this has a RS-232 or a network cable and a USB 
Before you go any farther, go to YouTube and look up Arc Droid. It's two words. Probably use the parentheses around it to make sure you find it. And on their channel, Andrew has six videos set up. It's labeled step one through step six on how to set up the Arc Droid and how to do certain tasks like calibrating. He doesn't go into how to set up the calibration tools, but so I'm gonna go through everything I do to set up the arc droid and get my first cut done, just so I can document it. And hopefully, if I blow up my machine, you can keep from doing that too.